Hey everyone, it's July 10th, 2011, and I'm glad to actually announce that I finally finished uh, Fallout New Vegas. And uh, before all you people uh, start commenting on that this game came out a year ago, I just want to say that uh, just recently Obsidian came out with their fifth patch which finally squashed about 98% of the bugs, I would have to say, if not all of them. Um, I can't say they squashed all of them because I didn't do absolutely every single quest, but I would say I did about 90% of them. And uh, now that I'm done with the game, I just wanted to give you my opinion on the game now that it's fully patched. It's really amazing that a, a game company takes this long to patch a game, you know, almost like a year after it's released you know it just I know it's hard to uh, actually get all the bugs before you release it but this game was very very buggy but I'm glad to actually say now that the the patch that they came out with on July 8th uh, I think it was for the Xbox 360 they made a patch for the PS3 and the PS3 and the PC so July 8th was the uh, Xbox 360 one so I finally got to pick up a copy uh, and I actually played it all the way through. I took the uh, NCR route and uh, it really doesn't matter which uh, faction you take because it pretty much ends the same. You just get a different, uh, you know, different uh, slideshows at the very end. Um, if anyone wants to play this game, I have to uh, give a caveat that you really need uh, the companions so you're allowed to bring one human companion and one non-human companion whether that's a dog or a robot or uh, Edie I think the robot's name is and I took the dog Rex and I ended up taking Boone as my companions and they did very well um, actually uh, they took care of most of the uh, death claws and they took care of most of those golden geckos and those uh, I don't know what you call them those golden winged uh, flying things. So those were the hardest creatures. The golden winged uh, things and the uh, death claws were just absolutely impossible if you have no companion with you. Um, I played the whole thing, got to the very end, and I can honestly say that the uh, end of the game is pretty tough. Um, it's very hard. They throw a lot of enemies at you, but with the companions it's not that bad because you could just sit back and have the companions actually take care of things for you. So, uh, with the Companions, it's a much easier game. Uh, now that I'm done with it, I'm actually uh, going, uh, just picking up all the other side quests. You know, the side quests that I didn't do. Um, I don't think I did the Helios one, so I just, you know, wanted to look at that. Helios one I just finished. Um, and maybe I'll just check out uh, all the vaults that have you uh, going. What amazed me about the game, actually, is that uh, when you play the main quest, it really doesn't take you to too many of these places. Like, uh, the main quest does not include Helios 1, uh, which is pretty amazing because that's a pretty cool area to go to. Uh, that's not even one of the uh, options. You would think uh, that would be one of the options, but it's not. At least it's not when, the, when you pick the NCR route. I don't know, maybe when you pick the Legion route, they have you zapping the NCR. I don't know. But, um,. I finished the game and now I'm going to keep it, uh, try and get a couple of different quests uh, and different, uh, just for the, you know, the achievements, I just want to pick up some of the extra achievements if there are any extras. Uh, so that's pretty much it, um, the game is now patched fully and it was a very enjoyable game. Uh, after I'm done I'll probably sell it on eBay, uh, but again, Fallout New Vegas, finally done, finally fixed. Take it easy, folks. Be well. Bye.